Hello, lovely humans. It is Molly from Molly Reads and Writes, and today um, I'm going to share with you my workspace reorganization thing. Let's get straight into it. get my little plant thing on my shelves and just kind of clean up so that I could reset and start to get some work done. So let me take you and kind of show you what everything is. So this shelf here is my TBR books, which is all the books I have not read yet. And I was getting a little stressed having them all face out and not being able to pick, so I just turned them all backwards. I have a general idea of exactly where things are and that is enough for me, so I can just kind of reach in and pick one at random when I want to read something else, and then I just don't have to put thought into it. And then I have my little plant case, and me. Hello. Um, I got this because one of my cats, Jude, has a particular liking for eating my plants, 
so I'm trying to keep them a little safer. And then we have just my little writing space. I tried to clear it off and declutter it a bit and add in my new plant, this guy right here. So cute. Then we have my cork board for all my plotting. Right now it's a murder board for the Hunt a Killer subscription box that my sister and I do together. And, oh, gotta move that stand. Here, I just have a bunch of boxes of random stuff. Writing stuff, camera gear, beading stuff, trinkets. And then I've got my teaching supplies up there. Coloring books and loose paper there. TBR books for the next month and a bit, notebooks and other writing stuff. What I'm currently working on for my writing, plus my YouTube planning book, and then just some random stuff. Random stuff. Random stuff. And there you have it. It's my writing space. So, I would like to know, and you should tell me in the comments down below, what is your writing space? Do you use a couch, a bed, a dedicated desk, a dedicated room. Do you go out to the library, to a coffee shop? You should tell me, because I'm curious. I write here a lot, and then I also like to write out at Starbucks for some background noise and just a change of scenery. I find that very helpful. So, if you enjoyed this video, you should like it and subscribe to see more in the future. You can also hit that notification button to get notified when I do post more videos, which I slacked a bit. And I, I'm, we're going to make a schedule right now. A, a proper posting schedule for when February's done. Anyway, you're awesome. Thanks for hanging out with me and watching this. And I hope you have an awesome